Hi, this is Autumn from Bear Creek Nature Center, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make some fun springtime flowers using items that you can probably find around your house. Here's what you'll need. Paper, paint, any kind will do, but washable's probably best. A fork, a green colored pencil, marker, or crayon, and any other item that you think might be fun to use. I'm using Q-tips and an eraser. You will also need a plate to put your paint on and probably some paper towels because it could get messy. Step one, we are going to draw some stems and leaves. You can make these however you want. They could be long, short, thick, skinny, however you like your plants. Maybe go outside and look at some of the plants in your own backyard and get some inspiration from there. Next step, we're going to put some paint on our plate so we can put our fork in it. You need quite a bit of paint for this because the fork needs a little bit on the back. So we'll rub it in, get enough paint on your fork, so it looks like that. Now that I have my fork covered in paint, I will put it down on one of my stems, like so. And I'll do another one. Like that, and you have fork flowers. Okay, now I'm going to add a bit of another color to mix some colors around. And I'm going to use my eraser. Stick it in there, into the paint. Now I will make a flower. Like that. And I know not everyone has as cool shaped of erasers as me, but any kind of eraser or sponge will give you a fun result. All right, now I'm going to use a Q-tip and get that covered up. And then I will make another kind of flower just using the dots of the Q-tip. So I hope that you have enjoyed this craft and I hope you try it yourself. Stay safe and healthy and have a great day.